If you love talent shows, then you will enjoy watching America's Got Talent and The Voice. Gabriella LaBerge, a violinist and the singer, must be well known to all of you. Yes, Gabriella has appeared on two of the most prestigious talent shows in history. Not only that, but she has wowed the judges on both TV shows. So today we'll take a closer look at Gabriella LaBerge's life. But before we continue, a gentle reminder to all our lovely viewers, please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon for more entertainment updates. Gabriella LaBerge is a 28-year-old French-Canadian singer, songwriter and violinist. Gabriella studied music, composing and recording as a child. She also learned to play the guitar and piano, eventually becoming a talented multi-instrumentalist and singer. The 28-year-old has a successful music career, having started playing violin at the age of six, singing at the age of 11, and competing in numerous talent hunts. In 2015, she published her debut album, The Story of Oak and Leafless, as well as her first EP, Wild the Oak. Gabriella LaBerge did not become famous until the following year, when she competed in season five of The Voice France. What happened to Gabriella LaBerge on AGT? Gabriella LaBerge auditioned for the 16th edition of AGT. The violinist, as expected, wowed the judges, especially the obstinate but brilliant Simon Cowell, with a stunning rendition of James Blunt's Goodbye My Lover, showcasing her violin skills. With her first note on her violin, she caught the judges off guard, and the audience erupted in applause as she sang the song's opening line. Gabriella won the hearts of millions once more, garnering a standing ovation from all four AGT judges. Did Gabriella LaBerge get eliminated from AGT? It's sad to hear, but Gabriella had to exit from the competition despite the singer having the judges rise from their seats. Her card was looked at throughout the reviews, but it didn't make it to the top 36. And that was the end of Gabriella's AGT journey. Since the AGT's door closed for Gabriella, that wasn't her only participation in the talent show. So now let's get to know more about the Burgess journey to fame. Did Gabriella win The Voice? Gabriella wowed the crowds and judges on France's The Voice in 2016 with an incredible performance of Coldplay's The Scientist. Her performance video has been seen over 72 million times since then. Not to mention the singer shot to stardom after her audition video for The Voice went viral. It garnered her a large following, not only in France, but also internationally. Gabriella did not win The Voice despite her excellent performances, but she did make it to the quarterfinals. Gabriella qualified for the battle rounds, then live performances, before being eliminated in the quarterfinals of The Voice France. The 28-year-old performer's journeys on American Idol and The Voice ended in tragedy. However, this has had little effect on LaBerge's performance. Indeed, she gained confidence as a result of her international recognition, as a result of her appearances on the world's biggest stage. What is Gabriella LaBerge doing now? Without a doubt, the French-Canadian singer has established herself in the music industry. The singer has released two albums so far. Gabriella, The Story of Oak and Leafless was released in 2015 and Etranger was released in 2019. Gabriella is now working on her third album, which will be released soon. She also keeps in touch with her followers by performing in front of them. Laberge has recently performed in Paris. Talking about Gabriella's net worth, the French-Canadian singer is reported to be worth $1 million. Her tracks bring in a substantial chunk of money for her. She also makes a lot of money from numerous concerts and performances. The violinist singer also has 327,000 subscribers on her YouTube channel, where she posts music covers and her own tunes. With this, we've come to the end of the video. What do you think of Gabriella LaBerge and her songs? Let us know in the comments section below. And don't forget to hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.